Welcome to LMS channel, a channel to share latest scientific technology and information. It has been a while since we have the idea to start sharing journey and here we are with a good starting in year 2022. The topic today will be introduction of polyolefin characterization. Many will ask what is the difference in between polymer and polyolefin is. If you were in polymer or plastic or resin manufacturer sector, at least you know what is the difference. Pretending you don't know about the difference, polyolefin considered as sub of polymer and it basically produced using ethylene and propylene monomers. They are produced as homopolymers such as polypropylene and polyethylene. They are produced as a core polymer as well. Core polymers are formed when alpha olefins repeated with butene octene or repeated ethylene for PE or PP-PE core polymer respectively. Simply to say, polyolefin backbone chain consists of carbon and hydrogen atoms. Polyolefins are found in a large variety of applications due to its versatility and different properties, which can be achieved by different production design. Versatility of polyolefins are caused by different microstructural distribution. It can be controlled in different ways, for instance, molecular mass, chemical composition, stereochemistry, core monomer sequence length, and long chain branching. The most important contribute to microstructural distribution are molecular mass and chemical composition. Indeed, they are directly impact to physical properties of polyolefin when it comes to end product. Microstructural distribution are not measurable by common spectroscopic techniques without separation of polyolefins. Hence, after separation techniques, it is easy to characterize in order to identify polydispersity. Broad or narrow molecular mass distribution can be analyzed even though they might have similar viscosity or melt flow. Homopolymer and homogeneous core polymer are easily to be characterized in molecular mass. In today's advanced polyolefin structural, heterogeneous core polymers are exist and it is much more complex to analyze. It consists of a distribution of chemical composition which require another separation techniques. For example, here we have Zeglenata LLDPE with multiple reactor to produce high impact PPE or other related polyolefins. Therefore, heterogeneous core polymer require to have both chemical composition and molar mass distribution result to analyze. To have clearer picture in chemical composition and molar mass distribution, we can illustrate in this diagram. With HDPE pipe resin and LDPE long chain branching as comparison, it is more suitable to analyze with molar mass separation techniques. Meanwhile, LDPE sample with dual reactor or catalyst as well as PP, homo, and core polymers. No difference can be observed in molar mass distribution. In chemical composition distribution, each sample shows its own pattern clearly. In order to analyze this distribution, we need to have separation techniques. To measure chemical composition, the most important is crystallization separation techniques with instruments such as TREF, Kristoff, and CF. For molar mass require gel formation chromatography or size exclusion chromatography. By adding in complementary detectors such as GPC with IR detector or TREF with light scattering and viscometer. Interrelation in between molar mass and chemical composition distribution are useful information in depth analysis. In addition to separation techniques mentioned earlier, there are also preparation fractionation techniques for both molar mass and chemical composition. After fractionation techniques, prepared sample can be analyzed by other analytical instruments. By varied distribution molar mass and chemical composition can be analyzed in further as well. 
In fact, the easiest and the most effective way to measure bivariate distribution molar mass and chemical composition is CFC. CFC is a combination of GPC and TREF technique to solve unknown polyolefin microstructural. Information provided is credited to Polymoka, who already dedicated to polyolefin characterization near to 30 years. Polymoka provides solution by supplying analytical instruments, services, training, and consulting. Basically, we serve polymer manufacturers, processors, researchers, and academic sectors. Thanks to this great innovation scientific technology, and it makes polyolefins a lot easier to characterize. What makes a company different is not product, it is research and innovative ideas. In the next video, I will share more about importance of sample preparation and infrared detector in GPC. See ya!